Yeah, man, see the different location this morning, you know? Yeah, man. See calm still. See, see well calm, but the wind kind of high. So it make your water choppy bit. Choppy a little bit. But can't tell which way current to go from here, so now see him way. To me, it look like I hope you see the current to go see him way. I'll go find out in a while still. Yeah, man. But the weather beautiful this morning, the sky blue, blue. Well, blue this morning. Beach lively. All the people on the beach swimming. Yeah man, so I go jump in the water and see where we can find this morning, you know? Yeah man. Welcome back to the channel guys. Welcome back to Original Living. Yeah man. We're out to do some spearfishing this morning. And this morning is a solo dive. We alone this morning. So we're not gonna stay long in the water, probably about two hours. Yeah, long time in a dive here, so about two months now. So I go up on the deeper side, go see what I go on. So we can come in back with this man, you know. Good place, always find fish on here. So hopefully, we can find a few fish this morning. So stay tuned, we'll go ahead for the water. <laughs> from out that this side come to this side because I saw me ago yeah man so to swim from there all the way out there is very difficult so what I did walk on the beach come down to this area right here and then I go head for the water yeah now so I get me stuff them ready from here so glass and things yeah man so out of water we got you know So it's a little bit murky on the beach side. So in some deeper waters now, it's a lovely school of surgeon fish slash doctor fish. I knew that this dive wouldn't be long, so if it cracks, I saw. Check them out. It's a quab there, that one escape. Here I saw a snapper on the bottom, about 45 feet. They could drop off tight, they saw me and move away. visibility wasn't that great and the current was actually strong and going up and out here I saw a lovely sized squid actually about four of them so I took the biggest one
I was trying to reset my gun quickly to get perhaps one more of his speed but my spear get fast down there so I have to go and retrieve it so I was trying to retrieve the spear quickly Squids were still around. The spear wasn't fast in that bad boy. Still didn't want to jog it from the top because it could bust the shooting line. So I go down all the time and pull it. I'm still seeing the squid so I'm trying to get rid of this one quickly didn't end up with any more of the squids as my bungee pop off on me there I saw a gold tail he's there so I make a second job I hit it, but the spear looked like it bounced out back. Hit the rock and bounced out of the fish, the gill didn't penetrate. This is a dive boat. A couple of guys were scuba diving here. Saw a few jacks here. Went down to check them out. These jacks were too small. So here I saw this jack. Line it up. Took the shot. Got it. This is actually my second catch. This is when I remember that the curfew was a little bit shorter and there's a place I uh, need to catch before it close. So I decided on heading in after I finish string up this fish. Jump out of the water, you know. Because never know, say. Yeah, Jenna, big up. We never remember, say, the curfew was kind of drop a little short today. And we need to catch somewhere before it close. So we spend about an hour and a half in the water and come back out. The wind is still the same way. Because I go out to sea. 
with the water get choppy. Yeah, man. But you find a squid and a jack about a three quarter pound or close to a pound jack. Well satisfied still. Me no problem when I get more fish if me did continue with the diving. But as I say, me never know the curfew was changed. Never know. Me never remember. I would mean at the water, I say, oh jeez, the curfew was I need to catch somewhere before the place closed. So I jump out of the water. I need to clean up the jack. I just go head home and then go deal with them. I have to deal with them because they know the thing. I don't want the place to lock up on me. Yeah, man. So, see me. See the jack and the squid here. Yeah, man. One corridor squid here, you know, me did one get one more still. At about five of them, they did it, but my bungee pop off for me by the time I fix what you bungee, then gone. Then I spear the first one. But I'm going to race him down. I'm going to do some curry squid one of the day, you know. Yeah, man. So, study jack. Nice little jack, let's see him here. Two nice fish. Yeah. I will go home and cook up some rice and peas and fish same here. You know? I don't have to cook the squid nor the jack. I will cook a piece of barra. Because I said the video before, I said I don't cook a piece of fish. A piece of barra and jack on the end of the video. I never do it. I don't know why. When I go home, a different food cook still. So I don't bother, you know? Because I don't want me alone live. So I have to eat some different things most of the time, you know? Some of the vegetables, them too, you know? So definitely today, definitely the piece of the barra will go up on the plate today. So I catch the barra already so I still catch and cook. Yeah, we cook up some of it already same way. So I go ahead with me now. So if anything, in the kitchen, see? Yeah man, so I do with me now, you know. I have a four slice of barra here. Yeah. yeah man, because I did cut them kind of big so it was three. Put some of the big ones on them. Get them down smaller. Yeah, man. So I'll cook up some barra, you know. Yeah, man, for Sunday dinner. Pot well at over here. We'll drop a little oil in it. Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't know. It's a pepper. Mm -hmm. Go up on the side, yeah. Rice and peas, you know. Yeah. So, one on, guys.
regular fried and cook down nothing special one more thing go yeah man We know it tastes good already. See how it look. Wow. Looking good, man. Yeah, man. Only for water and night still. So let me get one. Come down. Before we want it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. So, my circle back, you know. This look like a hit you now, so I will lock off this two in a one go. Yeah man. Yeah man, I hit that you know. This is where rice are going with. Oh yeah. Rice look like you're ready to. Yeah man, so I'll do some shear out you now and then eat some food. Yeah man, see what's going on you now. Maracuta well cooked you know. Two plate, you know, yeah, man. So, I'm gonna see what I go on for the food, you know. So, guys, remember as always, you know, subscribe to the channel, yeah, man. Hit the notification bell as usual, yeah, man. So, catch you next time, then, Zane.